At Duquesne University, police officers and security guards walked out of that door this morning and over to this corner to join their local union as they officially go on strike. Police replacing their badges with strike signs. What is happening here today is wrong. It's what Savannah Bunger had to pass on her way to class at Duquesne University. It's really sad. I think it's unfortunate that Duquesne is such an expensive school, but yet they can't come up with a livable wage, especially for the people that protect our school. The Duquesne University Police Department, represented by Teamsters Local 249 Union, spread throughout the university today as 28 police officers and security guards went on strike. The strike comes after eight months of failed contract negotiations between the union and university. The union says the university is trying to take away health care and they're not in agreement on wages and retirement contributions. They need to come to the table. They need to come to the table with some serious offer and understand that they're putting these students in danger, not the Teamsters. The Teamsters continued to work and they forced us to push us out of here. The university says they offered the union the highest wage increase since 2006 in the new contract. Their statement saying in part, the university's total compensation package offered most recently to our police officers and security guards is among the most generous in higher education in our region and includes other significant compensation and incentives. Adding in that the chief of police has a plan in place to cover the university in the meantime. Shame on you, Captain! Shame on you! So I think the university should utilize them and give them a livable wage and, you know, protect them like they protect us. From Duquesne University Police Department, I'm Tori Yorkey for Pittsburgh's Action News 4.